All right, it's Chuck Karstensen. This is my fourth live video of the day. Now, only the second one on the Karstensen Team real estate page, and I did two on my personal page, and now I'm out at a listing for the fourth straight day, and I'm in Cambridge, or outside of Cambridge, near the intersection of Highway 95 and Highway 47. And yep, so you got some road traffic, but that's why this is a business opportunity. So we had this listed before, now we're at a much lower price, the previous price was higher because, and and if you know Cambridge, yes, Michelle, and you like that, uh, well, you want to talk a lot too, but I, I could bring you on this, Michelle, and you could be like my co-host in the side video thing. I've seen it before, but never mind. I'm going to stick to the topic. So you've probably seen this brown building from Highway 95, and you didn't realize, or if you have seen this, you didn't realize there's 30 acres back there and there's a house and there's a garage and so the reason we had it at a much higher price you know what i think on the tag i forgot to put the price it's 349.9 is because the place next door which is crawford equipment you're not gonna see it really on this video but if you know what i'm talking about in the area that lot about 10 years ago was five acres and it sold for 171,000. this front lot of the 30s about 10 acres and we got 20 acres back there so 170 for raw land near the corner there's some commercial properties over there like the corner gas station the, the restaurant and everything so this is more valuable real estate than most people would probably give her credit for so now we got it at 349.9 so i'm going to take a pause while i walk and show you the property and remind you a quick note that michelle and i on our first video we did today we announced that if you're watching the live video or watching the recording and you share the video or any of the videos on our real estate page that we did this week, you'll be entered in a drawing next week for a gift card for 25 bucks. And uh, it's for interaction. So sometimes if you're not a follower or somebody likes our page and you see this and you want to share it, you also have to maybe just post below a notes that hey done I shared it so we want some interaction um, pick this video or another one and just let us know you're watching and then share it out and chime in on the comments below so we've got an outbuilding to show you I'm gonna step inside there just briefly it's it's got a little bit of clutter in um, and I always remind people too if you see places that have a little bit of stuff sitting outside the, the seller is gonna remove it People ask us, well, will they remove it? Well, we can put it in the purchase agreement. I know this seller, because it's my seller, would remove it. It's just they don't have to until they get a sale. So I'm, I'm just turning. You see some tillable acreage behind me. It's about tillable. I think it's 22 tillable acres of the 30. Of course, you got the yard and the shed. So we're going inside. I'm going inside the building. 40 by 70 outbuilding. It is heated. And I'm in the building. It does have a concrete floor. See that? That's concrete. And then up here behind me is a heating system. Obviously, it has power on and electrical. So 40 by 70. This overhead door is about 12 feet. I think it's, you know, 11 to 12 feet. So it's got a large door. There's extra storage slash office space on the other side. So that's a bit of a preview of the outbuilding. We'll take a look at the land, which means at that point I'll flip the camera and then we'll get inside the house and then we'll take a look at the house and then we'll wrap up the video so because this is 30 acres I have to walk you know several hundred feet to my next point of interest to show you so at least I get my steps set you know I got the Fitbit going and I like to get 10,000 steps so when I'm doing one of these lives at a acreage property it's a good way to get a few extra steps maybe a thousand or I don't know two thousand steps and so again I'm live in Cambridge Right off of Highway 95, 5030 Highway 95. If you know where Highway 47 and 95 intersects, the, the liquor store, the gas station, the Crawford equipment, this is right by that. I've got a billboard sign and a regular T-post sign out. And this one's 349.9. And again, if you're watching this, please share it out because we have a contest. Anybody who shares it, enter to a drawing. And we're going to be doing contests like this for giveaways for people sharing our videos. So do that, share the video. So yeah, let me let me flip this and show the land here. 
All right, so I said it's a little over 20 tillable acres, and this is one part of it. It wraps around, like from behind the house, you can see more of the field and goes out their ways. That garage that's attached to the house, that's 32 by 40 over there. So again, 32 by 40, very, very large garage, 40 by 70 outbuilding, we're just at 30 acres. Cambridge, Minnesota, relisted at a reduced price of $349.9. We actually started this at $449 because of that front lot that you know has a lot of potential commercial value, but now the price is way down. And it does have some handicap accessibility features like this ramp up going in. There's a currently a chair lift inside. I gotta catch my breath. It's okay. Michelle commented before that I talk a lot, so I can I can catch my breath for a second. Dead air. And plus, this is my fourth live video of the day, so I, I'm probably starting to run out of breath. All right. I'm gonna poke into the house, and then I don't always like to show the garages. You just have to trust me; it's large because you know people get stuff in there. Okay, so you walk in, there's, there's a bathroom off to the left with laundry. Quick peek. Not going to give you the best view. Here's the living room. There's a deck off the living room. Good sized living room. Kitchen, again, pretty good sized countertop in the kitchen. Countertop space, cabinet space. Two bedrooms, two bathrooms, then downstairs, it's it's unfinished, you know, kind of roughed in, but there's room for obviously more rooms downstairs, but I'm not going to show you that today because there's not much to show you. There's one of the bathrooms, obviously. So this is built in 1994, I believe. Good sized bedroom in here. And I am going to flip the camera again. All right. It's Thursday. When you're watching, so I know we, what we do with these, I, I reminded people yesterday, we're doing the live video now, then you get the recording, then we put these out on YouTube, and then we, in the future it'll be blogging. So you might not be watching the live video, but if you are, this is my fourth live at a property, four straight days. We've got a lot of listings this, you know, in October, now coming on in November. So you're going to see more of these. And we got a variety of listings. I think I, you know, I set uh, one in North Branch on Monday, then Kimball, Minnesota on Tuesday, Sturgeon Lake yesterday. That's farther up north, up I-35 now. I live in Cambridge. This is outside of Cambridge, in between, in between Cambridge and Princeton. So we always have a great variety of properties. You've seen us do some of our lake properties. You've seen me do these lives at our hunting land properties. And now we got one here, and we did. We had one in Browerville. We have one in Browerville too. That one in Browerville is a body shop currently. So we got a couple that have business opportunities because of their locations, because of the outbuilding, because of where they're situated. So we continue to have a variety of listings, which what I like to remind people, if you're buying, we see a variety of properties. We can help you in the buying. And if you're selling, we are more than capable of, you know, marketing your property, even if you think it's a unique style. In fact, we're probably the best ones to market, market your property if it's a unique style. So to wrap it up, thank you for watching all these videos. We want these to be shared. We want comments. And if you take this video or go back through our page, through the ones I just mentioned that I did here in the last few days, and share one or all of those videos, each time you share it, if you share all four or all five or all six that we end up doing this week, you get one entry. So if you did six, you get six entries in for, into our drawing, which is gonna be weekly for the next few weeks, next Thursday, since we just started the contest, you get entered into it and you could win, you know, we're doing some giveaways with that. So. Thanks for watching. Please share these. Thanks for your, um, you know, questions. Anytime you have questions, you can post those in the comments and reach out to us, obviously, directly if you need some help. Chuck and Michelle Carstensen, Carstensen team, brother and sister team, REMAX results.